Understanding what unit library you're in is very important. Over here on the right side, you'll notice it says frame. Well, this is a frame library, and if you go to put up a frame library cabinet, you're going to have things with face frames on it. If you want it frameless, well, you can drop down and you can select frameless, and this will be more of a Euro style, and all the unit menu options in here, as far as top units, base cabinets, you will find that when we click on them, it's talking about a left side, a right side, and it does have questions about left side reveal, right side reveal. Each unit menu and unit library has its own set of shop standards, so there are places to set your reveals uh, for standard, your top reveal for your wall cabinets, and your, your bottom reveal for a base cabinet, that kind of thing. Just like there's a place to set in frame the top rail width for the wall cabinet and the bottom rail width. And all these details are unique to each one of these libraries. Overlay frame, all that is, is basically a frame cabinet that takes the doors and sets a space to the outside like a reveal, so the doors work more like a frameless cabinet. Now, if we come down here, here's our closet library. There are all sorts of unique items that make the closet library what it is. We've got wall hangers, so if you happen to do wall hanging units, we go to tall hangers to floor for, for floor mount units. And what KCD does with these libraries is give you the best starting point possible so that you can get the job done quicker. There's too many times where reinventing the wheel when the reality is you need a double hang, just grab a double hang. You need a four drawer base, grab a four drawer base and modify it. You can make it any size you want. It's a custom cabinet program. And the idea is to save yourself time. More presets, faster things are going to be for you. So when you're laying out things, you're just going to be ahead of the game. And you're not going to be sitting there having to create everything by yourself from scratch, taking all sorts of time. Now, I click on closets. Notice I have the Cabinage library. What is that? Cabinage overlay? Well, Cabinage happens to be uh, a program uh, that we can take the units that are created in KCD through Cabinage and you can actually order all your cabinet parts through it. And that's easily done by going up to file after you're done with the job and request a quote through Cabinage. And Cabinage is a company that will do face frame construction. They have an, a patented notching system that puts the cabinets together in a really interesting way, a very strong structural way of building things. And they're cutting your parts. You get the order, they ship it back to you. And you add the drawers, you add the doors, you finish the cabinets, and away you go. Now, we also have accessories, which would be used for just, you know, little details. You want to put outlets in that job? Go ahead. When you click on outlets, you'll notice you have all sorts of choices in here. And you can pick one switch, two switch, or just an outlet. There's all sorts of little details that when you want to dress up the job to show what you need for the customer or for somebody who's installing, this just makes life a lot, a lot easier, and it illustrates what you want. Here's the Osborne Wood Products Library, which you can order. Uh, their items for corbels and uh, turnings and, and appliques, same with Adams Wood Products, White River Wood Products, and TableLegs.com. But essentially, all you do with a library is click on it and start using the things that are in it to make it a lot quicker and easier.